welcome to Al Ain. I'm here to test the new Vida Salt 2 and I thought that this would be an ideal time to have a closer look at this new model and to share some of the details with you guys. As you know, the Salto and the new Salto 2 were both designed by Matthew Vietito. But what's new? These are the five major differences. There is slightly increased volume in this area behind the seat, which I really like because it makes the boat more stable on boils and eddy lines. And oppositely, the stern of the boat is cut down a little bit to make it easy to turn. Compared with original Salto, the stern is a little bit wider with a larger surface area. The changes in hula are obvious. The edge on each side makes the bottom of the boat and the side of the boat flatter. This should help in a situation when you need to catch a hole or a wave between the gates. The cockpit is slightly longer and a little bit lower to allow one to lean backward if needed. The final innovation is the new seat. The front of the seat is wide and very ergonomical. The angle of the backrest is open, which allows for added flexibility when leaning backwards. The great thing about this seat is that it will never hurt your back. What I also like is that you can simply customize the backrest angle by adding foam like this. Salto 2 gives a good first impression. I really like some of the changes but I still need more time to test this boat and all its features properly. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Subscribe if you like it and see you next time.